he's a humble man, but he'll admit it. Governor Rick, oh yes, he did it. Around the fifth one summer day, they raised their eyes. I want to be sure you can see it, you know. Oh yeah. Is this an exorcism? What is a body? Gotta get my rose colored glasses on. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, let me see. I gotta, gotta, gotta remember what the first line is here. Um, oh, it's uh, no, no. <laughs> uh, you gotta believe. You gotta believe. Uh, what is it you gotta believe in? I hate it when this happens. Hang on just a minute here, I'll get it. Um, we have time. You gotta believe, you gotta believe in the pro life priest. There we go. Okay. You gotta believe in the pro life priest. Pray for glory. Pray for life. Praise the Lord and embrace the strife. For that God that we adore, we gladly fight a holy war. We love our nation and we love our guns. We're pro-life Republicans. <laughs> We're the blessed people beneath the steeple. We don't kill fetuses, but we kill other people. We kill them with guns and we kill them with bombs. We kill the dads, we kill the moms. Convicted criminals, A-Rats too, abortion doctors, to name a few. If you disagree, we're not polite. We don't have to be, because we know we're right. It's in the Bible, and it's our creed. Jesus wore guns and greed. With the sacred amendment, we will not trifle. Our Jesus would carry a battle rifle, and he'd have a 30 round magazine. Oh, it's the rifle of God, the M16. The Namby Pambies might think it's strange, but it's hallowed ground, our rifle range. When church is out, we'll have our fun playing Rambo with our guns. Just imagining the kind of people we'll kill when we're called upon to do God's will. Because we're sanctified Yes, indeed. With Jesus' war, guns and greed. Some folks say our creed ain't true. They don't know Jesus the way we do. <laughs>